So they're speculating about Robert Mugabe. So they're saying Robert Mugabe looks poised to set uh, or set to rule Again, Zimbabwe talking about African <laughs> until leaders. he Lord. is 99 years. <laughs> this is the same story we've been talking about the DRC. Mm -hmm. When families want to stick to power for as long as they can, when leaders are seemingly unable to actually rule because of their old age, but mm -hmm. they're not letting go. And we I believe Zimbabwe would be going to the elections, what, is it 2018? Yes. I think it's in 2018, and he is possibly going mm -hmm. to be part of, part of the, that election. Of the uh, election. <laughs> yeah, there was notion that his wife was also going to take exactly. over, but uh, yeah. we don't know how that yeah. is going. In fact, there was as, an article, I think it was by the same uh, paper that was saying that she says she's as good as president mm. because she feels that even if Mugabe steps aside or if he, uh, God forbid, passes away, she would rise to power and become the next president of uh, Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe. And hope, who knows whether this would actually change things because as, as at now people want to change, especially when it comes to the economy. Robert Mugabe has tried to change and revamp the economy but by rolling out a new currency. But it has uh, people are skeptical because he has done this over and over again. The currency loses um, uh, value. They resort to using dollars, but still it's not really working for working Zimbabwe. Out. So when yeah. this new currency was rolled out, it was seen as a last-ditch effort by Robert Mugabe uh, to just bring things, to make a change that is for the better, that will uh, give him good among the people and make things work in his country, but uh, a lot of speculation on how, whether this is plausible, whether this would actually And one work. wonders, after ruling for so many years, yeah. honestly, what is it that he can bring on board that mm -hmm. is new or new. good for that country? Yeah. Zimbabwe was once the breadbasket of Africa, as Absolutely. it was called. So you